Hi, if you have a use case that you need to know in Salesforce, which uh, alternatives are available on your .config, I will show you how you can do that right here. In this .config, you can see that there are three of alternatives, one for English, German, and France, French. So these three alternatives, I would like to know in Salesforce that they exist. So I can build some custom logic on it, maybe uh, do some validations, checks on it. And this is uh, what I want to have synced. Now in Salesforce on my doc config, that is a new field. And this field is called config metadata. So it's part of the managed package, as you can see. And in this case, it's currently blank. To have it filled with all of the uh, alternatives, you just have to go to the doc config metadata, check the checkbox sync alternative names, and click save to server. So now my doc config is saved. My alternatives are of course also saved. And if I go back and refresh my overview of fields in this uh, um, doc config, you would see that now there is a JSON structure here with all of the alternatives, English, Germany, and France. To retrieve these alternatives or to use them in code, we have actually created a class called config metadata. And here is a code example on how to use that. Let me quickly demonstrate. Here, my quote, uh, uh, sorry, my quote doc config has the ID that I copy right here. And let me copy that. And then if I go to the developer console, I have written some uh, uh, anonymous Apex and I'm gonna paste my doc config right here, uh, my config ID right here. So. Let me remove the one that was there and paste the one that I need. So I can just filter now or uh, retrieve my doc config here in code. And in that doc config, I'm gonna say that I'm gonna use this new class config metadata and actually pass on my doc config. Make sure that the field config metadata is selected from the doc config before you pass it on into this class. And then I wanna print out all of my alternatives uh, one by one. Let's take a look. I'm going to execute this anonymous code and then take a look at the log file. The log file logs automatically. I'm going to see the debug only. And indeed, that is English, Germany, and France. So that's the three alternatives that I had in my doc config.